Hey everybody out there on the internet webs, I'm Mr. Spork, and these are Mr. Spork's hands. As you can see, I got a little bit of Mexican spice mix in my own special concoction of really good sour cream and homemade mayonnaise. That means it's time for making elotes, Mexican street corn. As you can see, I've got a little bit of a charcoal fire going on here. Please do this over charcoal, because it tastes a billion times better than something done over gas. And as you can see on my corn, I've already got a layer of the mayo and chili spice on the corn as it's roasting. A lot of times you'll see this uh, roasted plain or boiled plain and then they apply the mayo mix and the seasonings afterwards. I actually like to do both. Once this comes off the fire, I'll put a second coat of that beautiful mayo mix, a little bit more spice, and then of course a uh, crumbling of the Mexican cotija, cotija, I can't ever say that, cotija cheese. Uh, if you don't have that available, actually you can crumble a little tiny bit of feta, and that works pretty well too. That will be the final topping, and that will make this into a fabulous snack or a fabulous side dish for your favorite barbecue. As always, thanks for watching and liking and thumbs up and all the other crazy tweety face space social media stuff that you guys do. And thanks for watching the ad that runs after this because that's what lets me keep doing this for you. You can find this recipe in all its glorious detail up on the website. Just click that link up in the corner and you will have all the info you need plus a lot of other craziness from up here in Canada. Again, thanks for watching. I'm going to go enjoy this elotes. You should go make some as soon as you can. Cheers.